Hello Junior Achievement friends, I'm Melissa Eichbauer with Finley Automotive Group and today I'm going to take you on the insider tour of Finley Volkswagen. To start, let's talk about choosing a reputable dealer first. It's really important to choose a dealer with a good reputation because you know that they're going to have your best interest at heart. A few ways that you can check a dealer's reputation are review sites like Google or Yelp, or you can also ask your friends and family for a recommendation or referral to someone they've worked with before. When you first arrive, the newest models are right up front and on the showroom floor. Right now I'm sitting in an Atlas, which is one of our new SUVs, and you can see it has a ton of features and options. It's got steering wheel controls, a cool screen, an awesome sound system. When you start looking at cars with features and options, the more you see and the more you get, the more you should expect to spend. So one of the first things you can, should consider is your budget. What can you afford? How's your credit? Have you ever had credit before? Is it good, bad, somewhere in the middle? Those are all factors that go into getting a loan that can change your daily payment. Oftentimes, there are offers for first-time buyers. You can look at offers that will help you get into a finance, which is a traditional loan, or even leasing a vehicle sometimes is a great option for people. When you fill out an application, there's some basics that you're going to need to have. You're going to need your driver's license. You're going to need your insurance. Sometimes you'll need proof of your residence, where you live, also your social security card, and your job history. It's probably a good idea to bring your paycheck stubs along with you. If you did this in a dealership, it could take a couple of hours. But you should plan on being there two to three. Or you can begin the process online. We have a really cool tool called Finley Joy Drive, where you can build your whole deal online and come in for delivery or ask for curbside delivery at home. Okay, I know that's a lot to think about. So let me show you where you go when you wanna do maintenance and service. Follow me. Welcome to our service area. You can see there's a comfortable area to relax and when you first come in, our team will check you in and tell you what repairs or maintenance your vehicle currently requires. Insider tip, regular maintenance will let your cars last longer. You wanna make sure you're paying special attention to oil changes and tire rotations and any long-term go long goals you have for your vehicle should be shared with your service advisor. Once you've bought your car, you have to make sure it's regularly maintained, but you also need to be sure that it's currently registered. Just like getting your driver's license, you go to the DMV to get your registration. You'll need to have current insurance, and you must maintain that insurance on your vehicle the entire time it's registered. Having a registered and insured vehicle lets other drivers on the road know that you're concerned about their safety and yours. Thank you for joining me today for Junior Achievement of Southern Nevada's The Truth About Being a Grown-Up. Make sure you sign up for JA's online class, Buying Your First Car, this Thursday, April 16th at jasnv.org. It, really it will really help you get ready to buy your first car. I hope that your first car buying experience is fun and rewarding as it should be, and these insider tips have helped you prepare for that experience. Bye, see you next time.